Hi traders, welcome to my live trade video here. Okay, uh, what you're seeing here is the second trade of the day. The first trade uh, is a winning trade that actually made me $410. <laughs> okay, I made $410 from the first trade and this second trade of the day. Today is 7th of September. And for this second trade, right, I can see the price is actually going flat. Okay, it's actually at the money now. And this trade is done using the overlapping strategy that I just formulated last year, 2015. And I've actually added into the course, the Binding Option Mastery course, and hope that you guys have taken this trade as well. This is an overlapping trade. Okay, a typical overlapping trade that you can take. Okay. Okay, remember to use the overlapping uh, strategy. There's a, there's a condition. Okay, I hope that if you, you guys uh, are not sure about it, look at it. Look at the course. Okay, go to the course module. Okay, I actually tell you the condition to use this, and this setup is according to the condition, which is very good. And I actually enter it. So uh, nothing much. It's just zero point five pips uh, profit at the moment. Nothing much, and we still have three minutes to go. So just hang on, and we shall see what's the outcome. Okay. <coughs> A lot of you guys have emailed me telling me about uh, one of the posts where I show you guys how I actually make uh go from a losing position to a winning position okay that's uh, exactly what your strategy should be able to do for you if you have a reliable strategy that's what it can do for you okay if you're trading by guessing trust me you'll never ever get this unless you're damn lucky okay so just stick to a strategy if you have one reliable one if you do not try to either formulate it yourself or learn from someone you trust okay don't waste some money guessing uh, your direction in this binary trading you will never get there okay unless you're a damn lucky person you always get it right okay which is to me pretty impossible okay okay so now still have two minute plus to go we just hang on the price is about 0 0.1 pip below and now you just zoom out not don't worry about this color thing the process is not important in binary option what really matters is at the final second whether it's profitable or not when it expires okay from my experience sometime you can be all the way red and final two seconds you zoom up and give us the profit there are times where we're all the way green last two seconds you zoom down and give us a loss okay so that's why the most important is stick to the strategy trust it that's it okay if it's a losing trade enter again using recoup losses to make it back okay so still have uh two minutes to go you see the price look like uh, it's a straight line one they always moving like square okay today the price movement here because actually the the price is being uh i would say it's being hold by a strong support and a strong resistance so now it's actually trying to move sideways <coughs> okay still have uh, one minute plus to go the price has went down by 1.2 pips Okay, it continue to move down now it's a uh, three pips below where we enter okay still one minute plus to go if this trade did not work out in our favor i'm going to enter the record losses technique okay one minute ten seconds the price is uh, three pips below where we enter Okay, start to move sideways again. <coughs> okay, now it's about two pips, but we're only left with twenty five seconds to go. So we have to get ready. Okay, so uh, this trade because it's pretty, it go very low already. So that's why I know that it's going to be a losing trade. That's why I enter it now. The next trade. Okay, still retrieving the position. So just hang on. So 
So the first trade is a four hundred ten dollars profit. Second trade is a lose or loss of five hundred dollars. So I'm still in negative ninety dollars position. Okay, so just let this trade run, and we shall see what's the outcome. <coughs> okay, can you see that? It's about one point, about zero point seven pip loss. Okay. There's nothing we can do about it, it's less than a pip. But again, in binary option, that's if it goes in our advantage 0 0.7 pip, we still make money. Okay. Okay, still three minute plus to go. A lot of people has tell, have been telling me about the yesterday trade. Okay, that's the technique that I teach you guys yesterday. Whenever you see a momentum movement, a sharp momentum movement in a particular direction, okay, that's when you can straight get in and enter a binary option trade in the direction. Okay, although this uh, sudden movement don't always occur. But it's a, for those of you who do not have strategy, this is a very good way. You must be patient and wait for it to happen. Okay. Usually, when spike in a sudden direction, it will continue for some time before you actually uh, start to go into consolidation. Start to move sideways. Okay. By moving sideways, it's actually a, a point where the traders, the trade, the market start to release the pressure. That means when it spike up, there's a lot of buying pressure pushing it up. Then when you move sideways, actually it's relieving the strap, the, the pressure there. Then you start to move sideways. So when the pressure is over, then the price will then decide whether to go up and down, up or down later on. That's how the market moves. So as a trader, you must know how to interpret the market. Okay, when you see the chart, you must you must be able to roughly tell. Okay, what are they doing? That's very important. Okay. So, but for, for those of you who took my course, you guys have skipped this part because I actually should uh, set, come up with a set of uh, strategy with conditions okay entry signal to tell you when to do it okay that's where you do not need to know more uh, a lot about this interpreting of chart which is something that not a lot of people like it okay it's just that I have the interest in it I like it okay <coughs> so you see the price start to move sideways again now it's only 0 0.5 pip above where we enter, we still 1 minute plus to go. And if this trade is not going to work, that's it, we're not going to enter the trade. Because the recruit loss is only done once, remember that. Okay, 45 seconds to go. Exactly one pip higher than where we enter. Pardon me for the voice because I have a sore throat. 10 seconds to go. Okay, expire. So as you can see here, now that this trade has expired, I will take back $1,730. That means I made a profit of $730. Minus the $500, I still make $230. Okay, one loss, one win, I make back $230. And plus the 410 that I win earlier on, I make about $630. Not a bad deal, right? 
three trade, six hundred over dollars. Okay, can you see that? Okay, that's all I have for you, I have for you guys, and I'll talk to you again.